Welcome into our Blue Ridge 11 studios. Not only do we have some regular season highlights to show you, but we're rolling out postseason highlights for the first time this fall. Last Monday, our regular season finale for girls volleyball senior night for Conestoga Valley as they hosted the Warwick Warriors. And it was a good night for those seniors. Lady Buckskins get the sweep in dominant fashion, three to nothing. On to Tuesday, big night for LLE girls soccer. A semifinal playoff doubleheader on Blue Ridge 11. Game number one, Mannheim Central with the home turf advantage against the Cacalico Lady Eagles, and it shows. Lady Barons, Hannah Adair with two marvelous goals to help send Mannheim Central to the championship game. Game number two, Section 2 champ Ephrata versus Section 1 runner-up Conestoga Valley. Two very good defenses on display, so it was only fitting that the game-winning goal came with five minutes left in the contest, courtesy Lady Mount's top goal scorer, Annie Slovak. Ephrata advanced the title game with a 1-0 win. That brings us to Thursday night, championship night in LL Girls Soccer. Ephrata and Mannheim Central, very familiar foes, the third meeting between these squads this season. Great effort from both goalies in this one, keeping a clean sheet for most of the game. Until Lady Mounts broke the tie in the 66th minute as Claire Schwartz's assist sets up Abby Wiest for the go-ahead goal. An eventual game winner, Ephrata, claims their first ever LLE Girls Soccer Championship 1 to nothing. On the Friday night, week 9 of the high school football season, Ephrata Mounts hosting Peckway Valley. And the Mounts offense was on display in this one, a dominating performance for Ephrata. They win it 56 to nothing, giving themselves a hope of having the first winning season since 2003. Now on to our players of the week. We mentioned them before. Both goalkeepers in the girls soccer final. Man, I'm Central's Maya Reed. Effort is Jocelyn Umana showing off their senior experience with some phenomenal goalkeeping throughout the entire game, including this save on an effort of penalty shot by Reed, as well as Umana's 100th save of the season. Shout out to both ladies for a special performance on a grand stage. That'll do it for our weekly wrap up. Stay tuned for some more playoff soccer on the channel this week, and we'll see you next time.